G'day, fellas, and welcome. We are here once again on Mega Random. This time, we're on the land version of Mega Random. Uh, we are once again playing the Delhi, and today, I'm going to try and bust the Delhi myth again, because I tell you what, I'm starting to believe in the Delhi Sultanate. This civilization, it's kind of wild, man. It's, uh, it's slowly but steadily rising up in, at least in my opinion, uh, the ranks. But uh, we'll have to see how it goes, as we do have purple that's quite close to us here. I haven't found any food, though. I mean, I've got food over here, but that's not really... I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna consider that. I'm not gonna count that. Uh, we might have a little bit more over here. It's always a... It's always tough when you start off a game like this. Okay, here we go. Food source. Have we got... Is that a gold source? That looks like it's... That's gold. Okay. All right. This this might do. I think we're just gonna have to go with the town center right here. Um, where do we put it? I guess we'll put it, like, right here in the middle. Because uh, we're gonna have to put a mill down anyway. Because we want to make sure that we get our extra uh, bonus little bit of food so that's a consideration but definitely a little bit of a late town center a minute normally you want to try and start your town center as early as you possibly can so this is um it's not necessarily a mistake for me it just it's not a feels good moment we'll say that much now let's talk a little bit about the strategy today there is a single sacred site and you know what that means it means we could look for a sacred victory here now do i think we could pull it off i reckon we probably i reckon we probably could uh are we gonna try for it yeah, we're going to try for it. We're going to try for it. All right, let's do it. Okay. Uh, there's a couple different ways that you can play it. You can go for, like, put your landmarks on the sacred site kind of challenge. Um, I'm not going to be going for that. I'm just going to be, you know, I'll just take the sacred site and then try and fake that I'm not going for it. And then in the meantime, like, just absolutely put a crazy amount of uh, keeps on the sacred site. Um, I could also just stonewall it out the wazoo, put some mangoes on there. I think that's also fine. If there's only a single sacred site, like mangoes... Oh, maybe we do like the Stonewall Towers because they've got the boiling oil as well. Anyway, it doesn't look like we've got anybody around us at the moment, which is very, very nice. Uh, let's go and start with that one. Actually, we want to just do that and we'll get a scout into some villages. All right. Well, pretty decent little position that we've got down here. I'm pretty happy with this. Lots and lots of wood, which is always great. It's always a relief to have wood. We've got every resource. It almost looks like I've kind of just started off on a standard spawn. Uh, this is, uh, it's rare to have this in, in Mega Random. Now, let's talk about some of the other things that we're going to need this game. We're going to, of course, need to get this up, this uh, coming through. So let's get that. Let's also make sure that we get our scout out there moving. Probably move towards the middle of the map here. Try and pick up some of those sheep. Uh, and, uh, and we're going to drop down a house as well. We've also got the straggler tree. Dude, this is this is a good start. I'm liking this start. Uh, probably not the best position on this um, this mill. This mill should have gone right here because then we'd have three immediately adjacent. But hey, it's all right, Drongo. You can't get it right every time. Well, I mean, you probably could get it right every time and you'd just be like Marine Lord. Uh, but uh, not for us. Not, not for us today. Anyway, so we'll start this off. So we'll go seven out to... Hold on. I just realized... Let's do this. It's actually not that bad. We're not moving them that far. I was a bit apprehensive at first, but uh, we're okay. All right. We got some sheep here in the middle. It is mega random, and typically there are more sheep in the middle. There's just a lot of resources in the middle uh, from what I've noticed. So I think we just... We could... We'll do two. We'll, we'll do two runs here. One for the... What do we got here? What do we got here? Oh, we got, we got ourselves a little Ottoman player in the middle of the map. Good luck, buddy. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like your chances. I'll be honest with you. That is a tough spot. We've found ourselves plenty of sheep out here, though. Oh, whenever you spawn in the middle of the map, it, it's, it always works out nice in the early game because there's lots of resources, but it's always a bit harder as the game goes on because more people just start looking at you like, hey, wait a minute, that, that guy's not, that guy's not doing anything over there. Um, do we just throw down a lumber camp here early on just to start getting our, our forestry upgrade? I think we're gonna do that. I think we're indeed going to do that. We've got plenty of sheep here, 12 sheep. We can stay out here for as long as we like, because remember, we're on the de on the berries. I see a blue king. Excuse me, Mr. Blue King, where are you going? It's going for a little bit of a scout. You're you're out very late right now. If I caught you with villagers, I would 100% take you out. So let's talk a little bit about longevity. What's the plan here? What's the game plan? What are we going to go for? So I'm thinking, keep in mind, this sacred site is in the middle, smack bang in the middle. So we could do a combination of things with it. Like we could just... So that is a sheep as well. Lovely. All right. So we'll do... I think, like, this is a reasonable time we can rally out over to... Um, rally out over to wood now. Is it, though? Maybe it's not. Maybe... Let's go one more on food. Um, so I'm thinking we're going to go Tower of Victory here. 
Um, because last time we didn't go Tower of Victory and we lost, so I'm thinking maybe if we go Tower of Victory this time we will win, which is pretty good logic, right? Like, I, I don't think many people will argue with that sort of logic. Um, so that's one of the things that we're going to be thinking about. Um, I'm thinking about playing Imperial Age as well. I, I want to play into Hand Cannoneers. I, I'm thinking that's going to be quite strong. And I'm thinking about threatening this with Imperial Age, but th there's definitely something to be said about going for it very, very quickly as well. Um, but I, I feel like you probably want to just take the site, defend it with a, a little bit of walls. Maybe we could do that. Is this like, is this the world's fastest sacred victory? Could, could we potentially go for that? I mean, we probably could. Are we going to do it? Yeah, we could. We could. I, I want to go Castle Age because look at the relics, man. Like there's, I see three relics already, right? Like we, we've just, we just got to go for it. Um... Okay, so we'll put Tower of Victory in the back of the base. And we're just going to go... Do we go slow age up with this? I feel like we probably do. What what do we get from going faster on the age up? We do get out to be... We get to start upgrades sooner. I guess that's the play, right? Like, we, we get to get all of our upgrades, our eco ups. Um, let's double check in the back. Make sure that we've got nobody that's hiding around here. That's going to be our English player. That's Sanity who's going to be aging up right now first. Um, and... We can probably afford to bring these sheep back. We do have 13 of them now, which is a decent amount. Oh, we're going to need that, that house up shortly. Do I need to send a villa out now? 20. Then that'll be 30, 40. And then this will be 50. But is he going to make it? Yeah, he'll make it in time. That's fine. Cool. And you guys can come back up here. Okay, so I think we might be down in this corner all by ourselves. All by our lonesome. So maybe we just... Let's get to Castle first, okay? Let's get to Castle. Take Relics. Then we'll take Sacred Sight. Pretend that we're not taking Sacred Sight. Maybe we don't even contest Sacred Sight. Oh, I don't know, man. I, I, I want to actually get a Delhi W because I don't have a Delhi win yet. Um, I, I'll be honest. I do have Delhi wins. They're, they're, they're all taking Sacred Sights early. Um, I just... I, I, I play a lot of games and I don't always record those games. And, uh, and that's where we're at right now. Uh, we've got another age up coming through. That's going to be from Vincent. That's our Order of the Dragon player. Now, we're going to go check in here in this little pocket because there could also be a player in here. I don't think there will be, uh, but it's best just to, to check, just to make sure. All right, age up's coming through slowly. we got... Maybe we go take the deer out there, actually. Survival Techniques is on the way in. And, I mean, we want to go castle. Maybe we just leave it. I think we just leave that deer. We can always come back to it. All right, um... Let's get Sanctity. Actually, let's not get Sanctity. Instead, let's get Scholars. I, let me explain myself, okay? Sanctity allows you to catch... To catch. It allows you to um, capture Sacred Sites in the... Uh, please. 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 Yes. Yes. Sorry, Pink. Sorry, not sorry. So... That was beautiful. Was that not beautiful? Admire me. T tell me, that was beautiful. Type it in. Say, Drongo, 752 timestamp. That was amazing. Thank you. Thank you. I, I agree. That was very, very nice. Um, so, Sanctity's going to take three minutes to get, right? Now it's going to take 245 because I've trained a scholar. The point is, it's going to take three minutes. It will also take Castle Age that long. So, why don't we just go Castle Age? I can see two relics, three relics, four relics. Let's just, let's just go pick up those bloody relics. Let's just go grab those. Let's bring these guys over here. We just want to rush up castle as quickly as we can. That's probably too many on gold as it is. Uh, what do we want here? Let's throw you guys down. It's probably still too much on gold. Oh, 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 oh. Don't forget that, Drongo. That's really important. House is coming up. What if he sends another scout? He won't send another scout. What if somebody else sends a scout? They could send a scout. That would probably explain it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where did they go? No, 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 no. Did he just have another scout in the area? And it was like, oh, yeah, by the way, Drongo. Uh, ex excuse me? What's going on in this game? I just... Where did all my sheep go? Feudal Age. Everyone's still feudal except for Pitmosh. Good name. A little bit too... Um, so once we get Castle Age, what are we going for? We're going for Combat of the Defender. We need stone. I don't see a whole lot of stone on this map. So we definitely need to be doing that. 
can't believe it. Where did they escape to? Those sneaky little sheep. He had to rescue them. There's no two ways about it. Either that or like yellows come in and be like, oh, cool, a thousand sheep. Don't mind if I do. Um, so we want compound of the defender. Let's throw it down in the back of the base over here, but we still want it in network. So as far away as we can, but in within network. Sound like uh, an insurance salesman. Compound of the defender. There you go. All right, so what's the goal now? So now the goal is... Uh, relics. One. Two. Three. Put you there. And rally like that. Oh! What are you? Order of the dragon. Oh, you're gonna be mad. You're gonna be so mad. Are there any more I can take from you? Because I will be taking this relic today, sir. Let's get you guys on stone. Are you serious? No, no, no. Ain't no way, dude. Ain't no way. He sent out an archer? This is a high level play. Extremely high level plays happening right now in this game. We got three relics. It's not terrible. Could be better. He's gonna be mad though. He's gonna be very mad. I would be mad. I would be fuming right now. Okay, so we got three relics. What, what, what is this bug? This has happened multiple times now. So he's playing Order of the Dragon, okay? So where do we go from here? We can we can throw defensive keeps up. Oh no, we forgot. Shit, 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 shit. That's okay, we can still put our keeps down. We can still put our keeps down. They only cost 720 stone. Let's go wall this off as well. Just so he doesn't have a sneaky back door. How long is this going to take us? Four minutes and 26 seconds. Let's put you guys inside. Now, we did lose that relic over there. Orange was like, was pushing someone. Uh, let's go for a keep. I'm going to throw it down here. So we want village fortresses first. Let's put our vills on this side. In fact, let's also help out. Because this is kind of important. Though he has gone for his own walls. I like how there's always one villager that just gets stuck on the other side. You're such a special villager. Okay, let's go take the sacred sites. I'm just gonna take it. Fucking hell, dude. You guys are so silly. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's a... There's a reason why people don't play this civilization, dude. This is the silliest civ. Okay. Now we can go stonewall that bad boy. Or... We can just put palisades for now. Just to make it look like we're not really that serious about it, okay? That's the game plan. We're not we're not super serious, yeah? We're a little bit serious. Like we do we do a bit of serious stuff, but not too much craziness when it comes to seriousness. Let's cancel swiftness. Let's get a couple more scholars out. 
King, you can go up here for now. There's everybody. So we're going to ta start taking the sacred site. If anybody says anything, I will say it's just for gold. Now I'm thinking what we want to do, because we have the temple. We have this landmark. I'm just taking it for gold, guys. If anyone says anything, okay, it's just for gold. Did I put down a Rax? I feel like I put down a Rax. Where did I put the Rax down? We can't afford that right now. We have a lot of vills on stone. Do we have too many vills on stone? I'm starting to think we might. We've got lots of food down here. I wish I could just get one scholar out. And not all of them. So no one said anything, which is always a really good feeling. I'm, j I'm gonna throw these down. Should these be in the middle? One could argue that they should be in the middle. Seeing as no one's come for this... Do I delete these walls? I don't want to put it right next to the... The central sacred site, because then people may see it and may know that I mean business. And I don't mean business. I'm a very, um, how would I say? I'm, I'm not very much of a business guy. Dude, where are all my vills at? Oh, there they are. Just remember, we don't want to go all the way onto the sacred site. Have we got village fortresses? Uh, it's through. It's through. We're online. I can confirm Village Fortresses is now online. Uh, let's take some stone down here. I don't want to build stuff towards yellow too much. Are we really going to do this in the Dark Age? Or in the Castle Age? I guess we are. I guess we are. We've got a lot of passive gold just sitting here. What are we going to do with this gold? Um, Mangonels. Mangonels. Mangonels are good. But... Let's get a siege workshop in here. Oh, we don't want to attack his walls. Maybe we just go into a market. And just keep making men at arms. Don't need to micro those. Let's do this. Uh, 
Well, he's gonna see. Oh, well, he do definitely sees me. We can say that much. All right, let's get that siege workshop down now. Where's my market at? Let's get a bit more stone. All right, we got four minutes left. No one's really paying attention just yet. Where's my scholar at? I did have a scholar up here. Here he is. Okay, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. This this is this is looking good. No one's even batting an eye at us. No one said anything. No one's smelling anything. No one's wondering where is all of that? What's that guy doing over there in the corner? We don't have the extra health just yet. Do need that extra health though. Our vill count is continuing to rise. I'm hearing kings or Jean d'Arcs getting sniped. Let's get this upgrade while we can. That's food. All right. I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this game 100%, dude. Dude, no one's saying anything. Dude, they don't know. Dude, they don't know. Delhi Sultan. It's, it's the most overpowered civilization that there is. There's no arguments. There's no discussions, ladies and gentlemen. This is it. Now I'm going to throw the keep down here in the middle. Let's get sprinkled in placements all around. We can afford to get some towers in here as well. Testicles has been eliminated and three minutes to sacred victory. Maybe people will think that that sound wasn't the sacred victory, but rather something a little bit different. I don't want to, I don't want to gather from this. Population increase by 50. I don't think they know. I don't think they know. I think this is it. I think this is... I think we've just... Have we just walked into the world's fastest FFA victory? Is this it? This might be faster than Beasties. I'd have to double check. There is a world... Actually, let's leave these vills in the middle. These vills need to stay in the middle. I think we can just... Do I tell them? Hey, guys. Do you... Hey, guys. I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna say, hey, guys. Oh, what about landmarks? Oh, shit, what about landmarks? <sighs> wall them in, wall them in. Uh, drop keeps down on them? What do I do? What do I do? Okay, sprinkled, sprinkled, sprinkled. Sprinkled, sprinkled, sprinkled. Oh, he could be thinking. He could be thinking. I don't like it when people think. No thinking allowed. Please, villagers, spread out evenly across the stone wall. Don't all go to the exact... Oh, the timing. Why do you fuckers all go to the exact same tile? Here, motherfucker. Build the fucking wall. Oh, you fuckers are so stupid. Dude, dude. Hey guys. Do you want to win? Or do you want to enjoy defeat? Everyone on blue? Yep. Yep, I'm on blue. <laughs> they just let me have it. Dude, okay. We we gotta start playing more sacred victories, guys. This is my tenth keep that I'm putting down. Is this it? I think 
What's going on? I don't know. I'll be honest. I don't know what level of people I'm playing with here. The last game, I had Conqueror 3s in my game. Oh, no. I had Conqueror 3s. GG, guys. GG, guys. Yeah, Pink's given up. Uh, look, it happens. It happens, Pink. Wait, where's my king? Wait, where's my king? Oh, my God. My king's down here. I never even moved him. He, oh, he just tapped out. He's just like, oh, actually, I can't win. Well, <laughs> this was the most boring FFA you've ever seen. This is... <laughs> Who would have thought it? Delhi Sultan just walking... <laughs> Look at Vincent in the chat. He's like, what? What is a sacred victory? Dude, I'm still trying to work that one out as well, Vincent. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh... <laughs> I can't believe this, dude. Look at this. This is <laughs> this is ludicrous. Okay, let's let's check in. Okay, absolute threat over here. You can tell by the size of the farming economy. Massive threat in the corner here. Phew. I can't believe the sacred victory actually worked. I think anytime you get one sacred site playing as the Delhi Sultanate, you have to go for it, right? Like it's just too easy, man. It's just, look at all, all my keeps. All of these bad boys have got boiling oil. We don't have the extra health yet. That's the other thing to note. It took so long for court architects to come in. Do I start working on that immediately? Like you go village fortresses from the keep and then you start working on court architects immediately? Maybe that's the play? Increase the fire armor of Stonewall Towers, keeps and outposts by 10. I mean, that's not really like your issue, right? Like your issue is holding the sacred site. You don't really care if they burn through that. Like fire armor, it's only units that really matter. Um, so that that one's, it's nice to have, but it's not a big deal. Uh, it's a big deal for like the Order of the Dragon or the Holy Roman Empire because they go for like a single bombard or cannon emplacement. But here for us, wow. Uh, definitely not needed. Look at this. He's, he's literally sieging down the town center of his opponent as the game is finishing. And I think that's just it, right? Like, you've got a lot of people locked out just based on position. Here, you've got a Japanese player in the back, ho an, a Holy Roman Empire player here, above him, another Japanese player. So these three are all kind of locked out because you've got the Ottoman player that's in the middle. So they can't really go through him. And then at the same time, you've got the, the Japanese player taking out the English player here. And then these two are fighting amongst each other. And we just waltzed in for the victory. It was the, you know, the perfect storm, really, where everyone was focused on each other's activities. And, uh, and nobody noticed the Delhi Sultan in the corner uh, of the party just telling everybody, you know, back in my day, sacred sites were the, were the only way you could get victories. And <laughs> anyway, we'll leave it there. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you guys in the next one. There you go. Delhi Sultan, absolutely broken. You heard it here first.